the fall, um, I definitely thought we would be back. I had a lot of hope and confidence that we would be back, back in class. And when it slowly got to that point of we were gonna stay remote, um, it definitely was a little heartbreaking at first, being a first year teacher, not being able to meet my students for the first time. During distance learning has been difficult for students. Um, and I know that a lot of students have been eager just to get um, into the classroom, get off their Zooms, get off their computers. The CTE Foundation provided my students with materials to make a kombucha tea. And for my Ag and Natural Resources class, we did the hydroponic kits, and those were amazing. And the kids were able to take those home and watch this plant and grow right in front of them on their windowsill. Being able to have something in their hands, I think they really appreciated. I know they did, because that was the first time my kids finally told me, Ms. Fernandez, we loved this project. And I saw my kids really engage in class because they had something in their hand. I was excited about it because we had a choice of what we wanted to grow. We could grow tomatoes, uh, lettuce, and basil, and I chose basil because I like basil a lot. And um, I was really excited because it was one of the first hands-on projects we got to do. We got these jars, they gave us a nutrition pack, seeds, and some little pellet that you put in water. And then you soak the pellet in water, put it in a bunch of ceramic balls, and then you put the seeds in it, and as soon as you fill it with water, it just starts growing. I've always liked making things, whether it be designing things. Right now I'm in my maker class where I get to design things, make things with 3D printers, laser cutters, stuff like that. And being able to design things that literally helps other people do things more cheaply and sustainably, that would be an awesome career choice. Thank you for the CTE Foundation for really supporting the schools here in Sonoma County, here at Cloverdale High School. I know that without those grants, I wouldn't have been able to give those kids the opportunity of having that hands-on kit to take home. Um, within the last few years, I know we've gotten great programs here built, and that's because of CTE Foundation. And so with their help and their support over the years, and hopefully the future years, they're helping Cloverdale High School grow into a program that all students can be here, find a place for them, and a pathway that they can find and love and enjoy. Thank you.